<laughs> you know, I, I'm glad you joined us so you can have some fun as much as we are having here anyway. Welcome to the show. I'm Teresa Livingston. <laughs> yes, sir. my name is Fielding West. And Teresa, would you like to see a little magic? I do always love to see well, magic. Well, uh, when I say a little magic, I have a penny here, and I'm going to get our cameraman, if you would. I want you to come right in here so all, with, all of our friends at home can see exactly what's happening here. So just keep your eye on this little penny. Watch very closely because I'm going to not do this quickly, but very, very slowly. We're going to magically change the penny oh. right into oh. a vintage silver dollar. Did you enjoy that? Wow. Well, if you enjoyed that, you're going to really enjoy our next guest. Am I right? Oh, could you do that for me at the ATM? Well, if I did it at the ATM, it wouldn't be magic, would it? Wow. Well, you know, 50 in, 200 out. <laughs> yeah, that's about it. We're gambling. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> We have a very special guest today. Oh, do we ever. We he do. was so good last time, and we had so many requests to bring him back. He's back with us today. Emails and letters, because he was really fantastic. Thank you so much for joining us today. Again. And you. let's introduce him, Mr. Paul, Paul Vigo. Yes, Paul. Hi, Del. It's a pleasure to be here thanks, with you. Thanks. Thank you. What you got for us today? Well, last time I showed you guys some magic, and sometimes we magicians like to take things a step further. Mm -hmm. um, they're psychics, things like that. And a lot of times people ask me, how do psychics do what they do? Right? Mm, I yeah. don't know. We'll start off here and I'll have you take the cards there. Okay. And you can go through there and you can think of anyone you want. When you decide you're happy with one, pull it out from the rest. Do I need, show can it I to I shuffle them? You can if you want. Oh, see, because the last time, uh, listen, he came off. on here. Because he's too good. Oh, uh, listen, he, he got me the last time. He's not going to get me this time. Okay. I'm going to watch this now. We're going to pick a card him. out of here. Let's pick of out. course, don't let me see it. No, and we haven't said anything Ooh. up ahead. No, we have not said anything. I also up. want you, you if you would, please, oh, yeah. to think of a magical word. Okay. Okay. okay don't but say I anything want to show you, it. and then you go ahead and show everybody at home. And I'm not going to card we're looking at. Okay. Now I'm going to take that back, and there you, you go. You didn't see it. All right. No, I didn't. I promise. Uh, I guarantee. You, I, I know what that card is. Right into the middle. What I want to do is to try to read your mind. Okay. Without touching the cards either. Okay. It's not very hard. Oh, You've done this before. <laughs> now we're doing comedy. <laughs> in fact, why don't I have you take the cards and okay. put them in the card box for okay. me? Okay. There we go. And I'm going to have you concentrate on a few things as we go through here. First thing I'll have you think about is the color of the card. Okay. So you tell me when you're happy. Don't give yourself away, right? Okay. Well, let me try this just to start off with. Looking at you right now. You first rode a yellow bike when you were a kid, and it had a banana seat on it, and all the rest of the kids in the neighborhood made fun of you, didn't they? Yeah, I, I've seen uh, those photographs. <laughs> you haven't seen anything. What are you talking about? Banana seat? Yes, I had a bicycle with a banana seat on it. <laughs> I knew that. <laughs> in fact, okay. I know the first boy you kissed was when you were 14 years old. He had brown hair, and his name was Brian. Did you tell me that? I didn't tell I don't know you when you were 14. You knew that too. His name was Brian. But I was... Well, <laughs> you were 12. I think I'm right here. Like I said, concentrate on the color of the card here. Okay. Mm, I'm concentrating. That was black. Don't give me any clues though. Let's see. Spade club. Very tense in the studio right now. I'm just thinking about your first kiss. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. About. I'm going to stick this. This is my first <laughs> thought. Okay. I've committed myself. Do you okay. want to hold on to that? Hold on that right there. And the card you were thinking of was Jack of Spades. No. What was it? It was the Ace of Diamonds. Yes. You knew that. Yeah, okay. and that's why, that's what I wrote on the sheet right there, if you'll open it up and look. Wow, Ace of Diamonds, check how does, out. How does, how does he... Ace of Diamonds. How does he do... What? You're fooling me again. Ace of Diamonds, how did you know how that? How did you know that? This is not, this is not a Mark Decker card, is no. it? No, and you did have a free choice. Yes, I did. In fact, do you think maybe even before we started that I could have known that you were going to think of Ace of Diamonds? If you were a psychic, you might have known that. Well, what's funny is... Over here in my pocket, I've had an envelope, and I've actually been carrying this around with me for two weeks since when you <laughs> called me, and that's sealed. That is sealed. That's right. glued all and the way around. I put my name across there. Yeah. Right? Maybe see there's something inside of there. 
If you've got that card in there, oh, I, get out of here. I'm gonna buy myself a box of bananas. One out of fifty-two, soon. right? Ah! No, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I had you think of a word though before we started. Mm. I didn't ask you anything about it. No. Started with an S. Mm. Oh yes. And oh. then a P. Yeah. Because there was something else that I put on the back of this card. What? Two weeks ago. What? My magic word? You put a magic word you on it? You did there? not. No, get out of here. If that says... Oh, my Sputnik! It says Sputnik! He said Sputnik. How did you do... You're a little scary, You're actually. scary. He's, very, <laughs> he's a very scary guy. That's... Yo, can you see it? Can you see this? Can I see? chose Look at the that. magic word Look at Sputnik. That. Sputnik. Russian. Right, and he wrote it's it on written there. written on Russian. the back on the of the card. card. That I, that, and you had that in an envelope, right? That was sealed, is that correct? It was totally sealed. Stop, okay. I can see where you went. Paul, you are absolutely amazing. In fact, for a man that does not believe in letters. psychic abilities, you could certainly make somebody a believer. Yeah, great talent. And you know what I think? I don't, Paul, your mentor, I reckon. I don't think we're ever going to see the headlines, psychic wins lottery. <laughs> but if we ever do, I'm I think we're going to see Paul B. Hill's name <laughs> associated with it. Again, Paul, I can't thank you enough for Thanks, coming Paul. back with Thanks us. Really nice. Thank you very much. Well, it's a pleasure well, to see you too again. Thanks so much for joining us. I hope he amazed you as he did us. Bye-bye. <laughs> Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.